Hey guys, it's me the mayor again, and today we have the AKT-1 Sport Earmuffs, a value price headset that offers comfort and crystal clear audio. Well, looking at the box, it says AKT-1 Sport, electronic earmuff, created by Shooting Sportsman. 25 NRR, veteran owned, design in the USA, that is a plus. Uh, includes some batteries, a storage bag, six times sound amplification for hearing the fast impact noise suppression. Enhanced situational awareness, multi-directional microphone system, memory foam cushions for superior comfort, and adjustable cooling headband for to fold in for easy storage, huh? Well, that's cool. Um, a lot of other knick-knack pettywax on the back, and uh, let's open it up. Let's just get into the video. Okay, open it. White cardboard. So uh, a little rough. It's a little bit scratchy here. All right. There's a. What is this? It's a secret note. So here. AK1 T Sport. Congratulations for buying an AK1 T. Okay. No. Oh, batteries. Batteries. Okay. So it wants me to put the batteries in there and uh, hit this knob right here with number two, and then number three is I'm assuming that's where the microphone is. Even tells you all the frequencies and everything that it blocks. Battery replacement, automatic shut off, all sorts of really cool options here. And it does come with batteries. These batteries are Duracells, not for retail sale, OEM. Opening up the pouch here, mystery grab bag. Hmm, it's actually a pretty nice little pouch. Feels a little bit like spandex, but not as uh, stretchy here. They fold up, pretty nice. Whoa. Pretty durable. Cushion seems uh, pretty soft. Seems to be adjustable here at the actual muff. It's not like an internal band adjustment. It's like a normal, you know, everyday use one, which, I mean, that's a good system there. Has a lot of tension there to hold it. And, uh, oh, it's got this little auxiliary jack here, so you can actually plug in your uh, MP3 player, listen to your favorite anime music, while you, uh, <laughs> I guess, go out on the ranch or whatnot. And there's the battery compartment. So let's go ahead and get the batteries in here, and let's try it out. All right, so, so far I've put them on, and uh, I can hear pretty well. Turned them on, turned them off already. Um, I will say that the sound amplification is not as loud as what I thought. Uh, okay, so these are my old Sordans. Um, <laughs> they're really old. I mean, literally, the insulation is coming off of these comm wires. But um, these will amplify really loud. Um, certain situations, you do need to amplify them like super loud. But most of the time, I usually keep it in the middle at level three out of six. These, I have to crank them all the way up to, you know, hear what I normally hear at like level four on my sword. And so for, uh, you know, of course, these are budget, you know, these are worth um, right now. I think the prices are around 120 bucks, 100 bucks. And these right here are like probably around 300 bucks. I really don't know. I haven't bought these in a long time. Um, but I will say that the sound quality is actually pretty good. Um, it is very windy right now. I'm pretty sure in the mic you can hear all the wind. And the wind is not really cutting out the mics. Uh, sometimes a lot of wind can cut mics out on the hearing, on the active hearing protection. Um, and I think it's, I, I think it's actually a pretty solid buy. So far, pretty comfortable. I've been wearing them for a good, you know, 20 minutes before I started filming. Um, and it's, it's very comfortable. The headband is nice. Um, the padding is not as padded as this aftermarket. This is an aftermarket band. It's not the original OE. Um, but it is still pretty good. It's kind of slim. Um, it has kind of like two like lumps right here and right here. Uh, but it's not uncomfortable at all. And I do like the size of the ear cups. Very good. And so far, I actually kind of like them. So... Let's go ahead and try it out on the range and uh, see how well it does with gunfire. Well, what I do know is that shotguns are pretty loud. Today we have the Mossberg 835 Ultimag. It's uh, Mossberg's three and a half inch, uh, <laughs> super crazy goose gun here. Uh, 28 inch barrel, a little bit of ports here. Uh, pretty fancy. Uh, let's, let's try this one out for the audio test. I wanna see 
what a shotgun does to these headsets. I want to see, you know, if they do have the noise cancellation where it's fast enough to make sure it cuts off that harsh noise before it reaches my ears. So my ears may bleed if this does not work. <laughs> All right, well, let's load this thing up here. We've got some shells here. Estate bird shot. It's just bird shot. It's nothing, you know, really fancy like buck or slug or anything like that. And actually with an 835, most of the barrels uh, have a do not use slugs because the barrels are actually overboard to 10 gauge instead of 12 gauge. There we go. I got six shells in the tube and one in the gun. So it's ready to fire. All I have to do is say make ready and start. Here we go. Let's see what it sounds like. Wait, is that, that's a Terminator over there. He was sneaking up on us while I was filming. He's trying to take me out. Got one more. <laughs> Seventh extra. Clear. Worked really, really well. Now the recoil did kind of pop this back just a hair. That's why there's a cutout here. That cutout is supposed to stay kind of, you know, out of the way, out of the uh, riser or the comb. So whenever you shoot, it's kind of angled a hair. But the way that I shoot, it it's kind of hitting that ridge right there. So it does pop off a little bit. So whenever you use this headset with this shotgun, because this comb, eh, it's a little bit more of a bird gun, you know, to get a good cheek wield on it. But what you want to do is you want to kind of just kind of consciously think about that before you do it, before you shoot with it. So it did not knock them off all the way. It just kind of pushed them a little bit and it did not hurt my ears. So these headsets are good to go. Um, they, it did cut out every shot that I took. So it's working really, really good. Let's try out a little bit of something extra here. I got some uh, Federer. Better brand. I've never even used this brand before. Uh, double odd buck. Put one in there. Close up the chamber. Remember, always keep it on safe when you're manipulating it. I got a few in here. It's a little bit of a heavier loading, so let's just try a couple of rounds here. And that Terminator, that birdshot didn't do nothing to him, so we need to kind of step up the game a little bit. Perfect. You heard those hits on target. You could definitely tell that was buckshot. I will say this shotgun is pretty good at soaking up the recoil. I really like it a lot. And see, I didn't even notice the headsets cutting out or anything. See, I started talking about the shotgun. I didn't even talk about the hearing protection. <laughs> the, the audio compression is really good. Um, I will say my voice is a little bit louder than most, so it my voice actually cuts it out a little bit faster or it, it's like a little bit of staticky um but this this, uh, this shotgun is working 100 percent, and my hearing protection is working 100 percent, which it should be and that time i consciously knew where the headset sits on the comb did not even move at all even with the heavier recoiling buck so in the end i think that this shotgun and <laughs> this headset are great are good to go i really really enjoy shooting shotguns a lot it's kind of a secret of mine i know i shoot ak's and ar's a lot and uh more ak's a lot not much ar's i was just kidding i'm just trying to appease the air crowd but this combo works out very well for a hunter oh perfect perfect hogs perfect you know active shooting you know perfect and if you get tired of hearing the outside world you can isolate yourself and turn them off with a spin of the wheel. All right, guys and gals. Well, there you have it. Now I sound weird if I don't turn them on. <laughs> so there you have it. This headset is working very, very good. And I, I recommend them. AKT1 Sports. Hey, definitely. Thanks, guys, for an awesome headset at a good price. We want a good price these days. Everything's going up. Gas is going up. Food is going up. Ammunition is going skyrocketing up, especially certain ammo brands, unfortunately. And... This headset is definitely a great bar, mayor approved. If you like the video, plus one, thumbs up, comment in the comment box below, tell me what you want me to review next, and um, definitely, I 
I test this stuff right here. So you can too. So you can get out there and enjoy your hunting sports or even if you have a chainsaw or something else crazy, you know, like a loud compressor or a loud machine. These are awesome to be able to work and to talk at the same time. That's the mayor. Thanks for watching.